Mountain tops of the giant ice, I think. So the ice community do you get their uh, representation here? All right, let's see what we got. If it's like ice and tech, I'm such a fan. I actually have a, a couple that I win on this exact style from last year, where I beat Mika one versus one in the finals. Truly a magical moment. But I did it off stream. Oh my god, that was bait. I legit got it, but it was off stream. I was in voice call with my friends and then I started doing well and I, was, I just muted to focus. And then... Uh, easy win. But every other ice couple today where I've played against them in like top 5 I've lost, so... Mika is still the GOAT. This looks basic, but fun. Sometimes... The easiest solution to a problem is the best one. You don't need to make it more complicated. Just a clean, fun ice track will always be fun. No matter how you build it. Ooh. Now, figuring out exactly how to gain the most speed here is going to be the main challenge, I think. Like, always about exit speed, because the middle parts are not even drifts, they're full speed. So I think that matters a lot. Oh god. Oh, I think here, actually, you want to go wide, a, a little bit wide on the first road. To get this. I think that should gain. And then straighten early so you get down here. Extend that ice slide. This is pretty fast. Pretty sharp turn right here. Avoid air time. Early setup. Into what? I forgot this part. Into what? Into what? I don't even remember the, these turns. Do not remember driving them at all. Left ice slide into finish. Okay. Yes. I'm registering it. Oh. Very good. Sharp one. Stay on the lower part of this block. Definitely early setup. And then... Oh, that's wide. Might still be good, though. Ah! Uh, still PB? Yes. Okay, that's a good reference, Ghost. Because that was about 45 seconds, if I finished it. Streamer El Nosaba, is there a risky finish I'm missing? Oh! Okay. Matt, okay. okay. No, that was actually pretty fast, then! That was actually pretty fast! I will say, and I've said this before, I genuinely do not like the concept of risky finish and safe finish. It's fine in um, esports tournaments to like make things more interesting, like it's never over until the finish, but every couple of the day having some weird jump to finish, I don't know. It feels forced. 
So then you would just do this. Bro, I'm like top three pace. And then I just keep going for this like save finish, man. <laughs> you sound sick. Yeah, I have had uh, the flu for the last couple of days. So I had fever, pretty bad cough, and um, some headaches and stuff, but it is subsiding. My body is winning the war. Just need to give it a few days to recover. It's gonna be a close fight. I don't think I'm safe with my current time. It's just a little bit outside like the Div 1 window. 44.3 and you're in. That is a tricky section. That is a very tricky section. Okay, I need... I don't know what I need in that middle part. I need something there, because what I'm doing is not working. Too wide. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. But I don't have a lot of time here. Yeah, I gotta improve. Three minutes. It is basically confirmed at this point that my time is not Division 1. Try to stay there, that's very good. So wide again. Oh, uh, this is gonna struggle to be faster. Nah, no, it's so tricky. That's that entire combination. I'm I'm losing faith here. We'll see. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, last one, guys. Make or break. Come on. He clutches those, he clutches those! He pulls a virtual and goes to Division 1. Whew. Top 7 even. But alright, it's starting. Division 1. This is the no knockout round. And uh, let's see how we do. I do not think I'm going to play with Carson, by the way. I was just curious how it looks like. But ping differences makes the cars teleport a lot. We look like, uh, what do you call that? Like a herd of fish? Like a stream of fish? Not a herd. A school of fish? Is that what you call it when fish swim together? It's the school of fish? 
Why is it called a school? A swarm sounds better. Maybe this is a symbolic reference to school where they send us in herds to meaninglessly swim around for many years until we are slaughtered. Wake up. Wake up. Aware. Language reveals all kinds of secrets. Anywho, welcome to Couple Today. Division 1, Ice Track. I did pretty well in the qualifier, and I'm doing pretty well in the knockout. The very Pog Jimp. The first round can be considered a massive success as I take second place. Second and not first. <laughs> I should just quit. How can I call myself a Div 1 player when I got second place? That has a 2 in it. I'm basically a Div 2 player. Can't have that. Honestly, to speed up couple today, why don't we just put 63 knockouts in round, in round 1? Why does it need to take so many rounds when whoever wins the first round is clearly the best? Like at that point, we can all just go home. That's a bit unfortunate. I don't think respawning will make it any better. So I'm just going to continue. I think respawning there just puts me into a perpetual loop of 360s. So I think I'm just going to... Yes. See, that's fine. Completely fine. I was not remotely scared. <laughs> 54 out of 56. <laughs> Stolen incident. I made a good call though, I survived, that's all that matters. Go again. That was very good. Bit wide there. I'm gonna try to. Oh, I love this line. That line was so good. I messed up this entry, but I gained so much time there, I bet. I didn't look at the splits, but I just. It felt so good. Going wide on the platform to set up for an inside ice slide on the next turn. Like, that's huge if you get that good. 1.3? Yeah, figured. That was personal best pace. Hopefully I'm, I'm able to replicate that. It, it was all because my entry. My entry made it possible. Very slow first ice slide. No rock. Oh, but this is actually pretty slow. Okay. Oh, Elensar lives! I thought I was gonna say I beat Elensar, but he survived. Just gotta not hit that rock, man. That's super scary. The rock is super scary. So I have two 54th and 9th and 45th. That means this is a good round. Look, now we know it's a good round. Oh, look at that. I can speed. So wide into here.
Yeah, that has to be it. That has to be it, guys. I think that's the line in the middle there. Okay. 2 and 54, 9, 45, 8. Okay. This is going to be a bad round. This is probably going to be a bad round. Okay, let's just try to survive. The Matt Renome. Not the worst. It's bad speed here. Cool. That was sketchy. Super sketchy because I got airtime. Hey, not too, not too bad. Consistency. Like, low 44s is gonna take me far here. Ellen Sar again. <laughs> Ellen Sar again. My god. He's feeling the nerves. Figures. Good save. I had a uh, slide out in the very first one. Uh, one more for the Believers, the top 32 one. Uno mas. I always overangle. Good. Top 32 is secured. Ellen Sar is still with us. Feeling good about this. <laughs> Playing Euro Jackpot with the positions. Nah. Nah. I've been driving so safe. I had to slide there, that's still okay. There's no good way to recover that otherwise. Forty four point eight is on the slower side. I wanna be like four tenths faster than when I just drove consistently. Maybe even like five tenths. Let's see just how much is enough, but Low 44 should go far.
Low 44. Beautiful. That's the pace I'm looking for. Oh my god. Okay, super close. Um, Bead, I think, is one of the best players on this. I was thinking Bead might be out here. And that would be good for us. Because Bead had the world record before the map started. Andy is very, very good. Gus is very good. Uh, Laser. Masa Mime, of course. No introduction needed. And then I think... Um, yeah, I think, I think actually Mime. The pace he has. If he doesn't make a mistake. Ooh, a little bit of a fling there. Okay. Mime and Lassie, this is what can happen. Is he gonna survive though? He needs one more. But I don't think he got it. Mime did not get the spot. Andy and Ellen are all out. That's a big knockout. That's a really big knockout. <laughs> this is why it pays off to drive as consistently, consistently as I do. <laughs> if you just drive consistently, then you go far. Honestly, skill issue not to make a mistake in the correct round. Where others make way worse mistakes. I can't be out with this, even though I'm low speed. Yeah. 44.5, still in top 16. It's a pretty bad ending, but good rounds. Let's go for top eight. Now there's two knockouts per round from here on out. Oh, again. I have this issue. That was super bad. I was gonna do a small break tap and I just hammered it. Oh no. Okay, not good. Not terrible, I need one. See, this is the skill issue part. You just gotta make a mistake in the right round. I don't get the problem. Why get eliminated when you can just make a mistake when others two do as well? I, I just don't get it. S seems pretty simple to me. <laughs> I so hope we win now, because people doubted last second. You're a bunch of snakes. Oh, let me go all in on doubt, because virtual's gonna go out. I hope you lose. We're not refunding. Good. Whew. You deserve to lose it all. Need two more rounds. Two more rounds.
Oh, wow. Okay, big mistakes behind. Also beat crosshairs today, very nice. Very nice. We get some, some small crumbs of revenge for what he did to my records. Is Gus an alt? No, Gus is a really good ice player. He basically plays only ice. He's an ice main. Okay, come on. Looks good. Close round. Oh, that's so wide. I'm scared. Oh, I get it still. Whew. I knew I went super wide there, but we get top eight believers you win. And the snakes lose it all. I went super wide there. Still good though. One knockout per round from now. Not unwinnable, this one. You still have at least two full ice players in here. Richie as well is very good on ice. Tunix. So well. Come on, get the inside one. Whoa! Big PB! And Gus is out. Gus is out. I got my first 43 on the board. Top seven. Be extremely careful with that. Oh no. That is so unlikely. But I'm alive here. Oh, I was actually feeling a win today, but yeah, no, they all survived. I was feeling a win here for a second, and I think that thought distracted me a little bit. Okay, we need someone to miss the finish. That's the only hope. But likely GG here though. Top six. Damn. I was like, I looked at that turn and thought, oh, one more break tap, probably not. And then I still pressed it. GG. We saw the potential. We saw the potential. See top five. I'm rooting for Juliano. I don't know if he's won couple of the day before. I remember he was chasing his first. I'm gonna check the couple of the day app to verify. But still really, really good. Happy with that, guys. Like, top six on a difficult ice map, cannot complain. Uh, his best is fourth. He has never won. He has never won. Richie has won, Deska has won. Bead has never won. And Tunix? Tunix has never won either. Tunix has never won either, so... Oh, he almost stayed in 100th. So there's... Still two players in that have not won. My voice is breaking. <laughs> I had a... Flu the last couple of days, so... Forgive me, I'm trying my best to cast. What's in the bottle? We got water. Water and tea today. I did not know Deska was this good on ice, though. I would really put the match right now in favor of Bead, but I'm sure he's stressed. 
I'm sure he's stressed because it's big stakes. You don't get better opportunities than this. You play a map, you get world record on it, it shows up in cup of the day, and then it's like, oh god, can I deliver? He's last right now. He could just catch Richie though if he finds the line here. Oh my god, I was missing such a good line there. No, I don't think Bead can. He's gonna try. But it's not enough. He's out. He is out. Giuliano, Desca, and Richie. The pressure's high. Let's go, Giuliano. Let's get this one. He's been trying for so long to win. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay. Things like that are gonna stress you out. I'm, I hope he can stabilize. Because I know I'd be nervous now for the rest of the run. Like, one small thing like that might lead to more. Richie has made a big crash. This does not look ideal. But he keeps it on, and he has this good end line. Like, this approach is super good. It gains so much time. The speed in the end. One versus one, good luck. Will be a first time winner. No, Deska has won. He has won dirt maps. He's very good on dirt, Deska. But let's see. First eye slide. Juliano with the over angle has to release early, get out of it. Deska, better line, but gets out of it late. Falls a bit on the wide trajectory. Deska has not won. Okay, so then it will be a new winner. That's awesome. I thought he had won dirt. 0.4 already, though. In favor of Juliano. Into the ending bits. Can Deska find anything here? 0.6 now. Bit wide from Juliano, perhaps. An opportunity for Deska to come back. 0.4. It really needs a finish miss or a slide out or something weird. Juliano, last jump. And he's gonna win. GG! Very happy for him. It's it's so memorable to win your first. I don't think he expected it on ice, but he's been close many times.